In a previous video, I showed you, how I made this Pixel LED controller board. And some practical application with it, using on-board LDR sensor, DHT11 sensor and a push button. If you haven't seen it yet, feel free to check that out. Anyways, this board has more features that I like to point out. For example, it has an I2C port, which you can utilize, to attach different sensors for your project. So in this video, we are going to see, how easily you can add an I2C sensor to your new Pixel project, using Pixie Master Board. This is Pixie Master version 2, which is available on my Tindy store, link is in the description. I made some changes in this version, like I replaced the flash and reset jumpers with push buttons. Now for the sensor, I am going to use this PAJ7620 gesture sensor, which can detect up to 9 different gestures. And at the end I will try to make a simple yet interactive, RGB LED board game using this sensor. First let's see how this sensor works. You need to have this library installed in your Arduino IDA, in order to use this sensor. After connecting the sensor to the microcontroller, according to the spin diagram, open this test sketch, from the examples and hit upload. At this point if you wave your hand over the sensor, you should see the gesture is recognized by the sensor, and you can confirm that using the serial monitor. So, let's move on to the next phrase. Ok, so you probably remember this triangular LED board, from my last PCB pyramid project. I still have 6 of this left, so I connected them with one another, to create a hexagonal plate. Which I will be using on this project. So, this is the code for the project. Here whenever the sensor detects any gesture, it performs a certain task. Let me explain this using a demo. So I connected the LED panel and the sensor with my Pixie Master board, and after powering it up it starts with a basic animation. Now if you swipe your hand in upward direction, it starts blinking random LEDs, and finally stops at 1. Now all you have to do, is to remember that LED position, and move a LED to that position, using gestures. You can use left or right swipe, to move the LED, back and forth. And if you swipe clockwise or anti-clockwise, then you can jump between two sections. Once you have reached there, use the down swipe to verify. If it is correct, then the whole panel turns to green. And if you are wrong, then it turns to red. Simple right? If you like this project, please give it a thumbs up. Let me know your thoughts, in the comments, share this video and subscribe. I will meet you with another awesome project. Until then, happy making.